my YouTube channel. Welcome if you're new. Hello, hi, I'm Casey and welcome back if you're a subscriber. You guys are the best. If you're new here, today we have a Zara haul. Um, the first one of 2021, which is so exciting. Um, some really nice like knitwear pieces, but also some bit that I feel like you could take into at least spring. And then before we get into today's video, I just wanna to talk to you guys a little bit about the sponsor of today's video, which is Italio Jewelry. I'm gonna share with you um, the pieces I selected from their website. So they're really affordable jewelers and a really nice little gift for like that special person in your life. So the pieces that I chose came in this absolutely gorgeous box. So like I said, it's a really lovely gift and especially the way it comes, it's like already like a perfect gift. It also comes with two little um, like gorgeous little gift bags. It's also got your polishing cloth inside and then also a certificate of the sterling silver jewellery. Now the pieces that I chose, which I'm really excited to share with you, was a set for like a couple. So it's almost like a promise ring, not like an engagement ring, nothing like that happening over here just yet. Um, but they're these two gorgeous rings, so like his and hers, and they had a lot of lovely options. These are the specific ones that I chose. So like I said, they come in again, these boxes inside that box. So it's just a really, really lovely gift. This is the one for him, so this is a men's one. It's just a plain silver sterling ring. Um, I think that was just really nice, simple, something plain um, to give your partner. And then the one I picked for me, which was obviously a little bit more splingy, um, and I fancy something super sparkly. So this is the one that I picked for myself. Please do apologize my nails, but obviously at the minute we're still in lockdown. Um, but this is the gorgeous ring that I chose. So it's diamante all inside and then all around the edges as well. It's absolutely just stunning. So I also have a discount code for you guys, which I'll pop here on the screen, which is very, very kind of Italian jewelry. So the discount code that I've got for you guys to use is KT20. So make sure you pop that in at the checkout to get 20% off even more savings of an already really well-priced jewellery brand, in my opinion. I do actually have an extra one of the female rings to like give away, so it is in a specific size, but if you guys want to have an opportunity to win that, please leave a comment down below this video. Just leave the hashtag goodbye tribe to be entered. If it doesn't fit you, you can always give it away to someone that you love and they'll be like, wow, thank you so much. So the website was really, really easy to use. They also have free worldwide shipping, which I think is a lovely addition. They offer a one year warranty with all of their products and they also provide 60 days return period. Nice addition that the company also added, which was um, a little way of how they sanitize and make sure everything is safe to come out during this current situation. So without further ado, thank you so much Italia Jewelry for sponsoring today's video. Um, definitely head on there if there's someone in your life that you want to treat to something special um, at a really affordable price for a great quality item. Um, so yeah, today's Zara haul. I'm excited in case you can't tell. Um, let's just get straight into it. Let's go. Okay, so let's get straight into today's video. So I have changed. It's a bit of a different setup. Um, I just had to pause the filming last night because it got really dark outside. Um, anyway, I'm gonna get straight back in with it all. So I've got lots of little bits to show you. Um, just for your guys' reference, I'm a UK size 12 and I'm five foot nine. I'm gonna go in and start with this piece, which I actually shared in a reel over on my Instagram and you guys um, absolutely loved it. If you're not following me over there, it's at with love Katie and two underscores, I'll leave it on the screen. Um, and it's just the most gorgeous, like really thick, quite heavy, um, perfect knit. It's a most gorgeous, like really soft, creamy color. It's not yellowy in tone at all, it's lovely. Um, I got it a size medium, it's quite oversized. It's perfect to wear with like so many of the leggings that I'll show you in this video, but it's kind of that jumper that's gonna go with everything and you're gonna be able to keep every single year. Um, for me personally, that's things that I love, things that I can keep year after year, they aren't necessarily gonna be in or out of fashion. Um, I prefer timeless, classic, classy pieces that are comfortable and chic, um, and that is completely my style. So I absolutely love this, I think it's just perfect. It is quite long, as you'll see in the cutaway, but I really like it, and the suede leggings that I paired it with in the cutaway, oh my god, you guys, they are the nicest leggings that I've ever seen. Um, so for 29 99 I think it's honestly such a bargain. Um, I would consider, if you didn't want it like to be an oversized fit, then size down on this one. I normally buy a large in Zara, always on bottom I buy a large. Tops I can vary between a medium and a large, um, but this is definitely, like I said, more on the oversized um, side. And then it's got these lovely thick cuff sleeves and a really lovely just chunky roll neck. It's so soft, it's really nice quality and I think it's an absolute steal for that price. While on knits, I'm going to talk to you about this one as well because this is just absolutely gorgeous. It's probably the nicest colour knit 
jumper I've seen. It's a blend of different materials, so that's why this one is a little bit more pricey. Let me tell you what it's made of. Um, so this is a blend of, so yeah, it's 23% wool, 34% alpaca, 41% nylon alpaga. I can't pronounce it anyway, but that's why it's a little bit more pricey. So this one is $49.99. I got this in a size large. As you can see, again, it's a little bit oversized. It didn't look too big on, it didn't drown me. I did really like the fit of this, but I'd say you probably could get up to like a size 14, even maybe if you're a small 16 on this one. Um, it's really soft. This one has got that like almost slightly itchy feel so if you're going to wear a long sleeve jumper under it like the long sleeve top sorry under it you'll be absolutely fine um i just love for me personally this color i just think it's really nice it looks lovely paired with like denim also would look lovely paired with white black and also the um um the leggings that i paired in this so then you could get away with like a faux suede faux leather legging anything like that in different shades i think it's really lovely like nice way to mix the neutral tones together as well otherwise like your faux, faux black legging is gonna look great with them all sort of things like that again single piece for the wardrobe never gonna go out of style absolutely love that jumper while we're on the topic of neutral colored jumpers i feel like i may as well share this one with you obviously this is a different style sort of jumper it's in between like a jumper and a top um it's a lovely thick knit though it's a really nice material this one is only 20 there's 25 euros so this one is only 19.99 so it's really really affordable and um, the bust area i love the neckline on this i love anything with like a slightly different neckline i think it's really flattering especially like when the collarbones are shown i think it's very elegant and like very ladylike i just love it i love the way this is like more fitted it's very flattering on the shape it's got lovely long sleeves on the arms i really like this one so i got this on a large and it was as you can see it fit really nicely um and for me, this one is slightly awkward with the bra situation, but you could either go strapless or like something and then just tuck the um, straps just to the side slightly, but it's just a really lovely piece and I think paired perfectly with like a nice pair of mom jeans like I've got on today. It's just like a perfect, easy, everyday look with some trainers or you could dress it up for an evening with some heels. So literally very versatile piece. Okay, so I feel like I can't keep these leggings away any longer. They are some faux suede leggings. Now, I've had my eye on some faux suede leggings for a long time. I've seen Mona Lux style them a few nice ways. Um, and I know she does have a pair in her range as well. However, I thought I'd go for these and try them out. They're high, high rise leggings. I got them in a size large. Now, the fit was really nice. But the only thing I would say is that length on the leg is a little bit short. So my ankles would get cold, which is an ongoing theme with like, Zara jeans, <laughs> Zara trousers, um, they don't really fit very well for a lot. Occasionally you get the rare pair that is like good for tall girls, but like if you're gonna wear something a bit higher or maybe a heel, it's gonna look okay. But if you don't mind your ankle being out as well, it's okay. But for me, these just need to be like an inch or two longer and they would have been the most perfect pair of leggings I had ever tried on. I am a bit obsessed though. I am tempted to keep them. I'm just not sure if like every time I wore them I'd just be annoyed that I kept them because they're a little bit short so I don't know whether it's just like hold on a little bit longer and keep the hunt for the perfect pair of suede leggings a little bit longer um for suede obviously um these are 25.99 so really really affordable lovely lovely color again gonna look great paired with loads of different neutral tones but also obviously things like whites and blacks really easy things to pair them with as well um, even creams like this brown, the two jumpers that I've just shared with you, look lovely like paired over this. I love them, I think they're really, really versatile. And um, they also, I forgot to say, have this little zip up the inside leg, which I didn't really feel like was necessary. I don't really see the benefit to that because it's on the inside of the leg, so you're not really gonna see it. Let me know what that, is that like a thing that I've missed or <laughs> I don't really know what happens with that. I was a little bit daring with today's order and I went for a few things. If you're not new here, you'll be like, hey, that's not really your style. As I said, it's very classic, very chic, very timeless. But I have not tried on a shacket yet. I hadn't tried them on. I'd never tried, I can't even believe I'd never tried one at this point. Like they've been up for quite a while now and I'd never tried one. So I thought it was time to try one. Now I've seen a lot I like and this will probably surprise you even more than this. I picked a blue one. Um, but I'd seen this on Olivia Atwood and it looked so good on her. I was like, I need that in my life. However, I'm not gonna lie, I don't love it on. I think on the right style, the right kind of person, it will look great, but it's just not for me, unfortunately. However, I do think it's beautiful. I do think it's really nicely made. 
I, I love all the details in it. I just don't love it on me. Um, maybe as like more of a jacket, potentially, but like to wear it as a top, it's not my thing, not my thing. Um, and it was a little bit on the larger side, a little bit too large. So I did get a large, so I'd maybe consider sizing down unless you wanted an oversized fit. It's 59.99, but I do, is it? I thought it was less than that. I thought it was less than that. Anyway, um, that's what it says on the ticket. Um, and then it's got these really gorgeous gold buttons. You guys know I love a gold accent. I love anything gold. I'm just the gold queen. Um, and yeah, I do really like it. She paired it with like these navy leggings, which I did actually think looked really nice. And I think a little crop looked great on her. She's very tall, very slim. It did look great. I think you could pair this with the suede leggings as well. I think you could also pair this with jeans. So it could be very versatile. Nice little white plain white tee underneath it but wasn't for me. I think I forgot to mention that I have found the nicest, and that's not exaggerating, the nicest pair of boots I've ever seen. There was two pairs on the Zara website and I was stuck between them both. And why I didn't order them both, I don't know, just to even show you, but I felt like if I ordered both and I wanted to keep them both, I would have been annoyed at myself. So I didn't. And um, the other ones were like a black mesh, pointy toe, high heel, ankle boot. They were divine, they were beautiful, they're gorgeous, and I'm sure, I'm sure they'll stop me online, that is very optimistic. There's two people walking past my window at the moment with jackets on, that's funny. Um, but yes, I found the nicest pair of boots, and I'm going to make you guys wait to see them, because they're just, they are worth the wait, okay? I promise you that. They are beautiful. I will show you a different pair in the meantime. Um, so these are a little cream pair of boots. Now I found cream boots really hard to get my hands on this winter, autumn winter. Um, and for me, there's just something not quite there with these. These are leather. I didn't realise. At £40 for leather boots, that's really affordable. Um, I am currently transitioning to be vegan, so I won't be keeping anything that is leather. Um, and I probably moving forward won't be showing you guys anything that is real leather either. Um, me and Reese were vegetarian. Well, I was definitely vegetarian. Reese was 50% vegetarian. <laughs> um, but we've decided to try and fully transition to vegan. So any tips on that, guys? Please let me know down below. We'll come over and sit and we'll have a chat. But um, yeah, these are leather, so just bear that in mind if you are vegan. And um, they are a really beautifully made boot. However, they are really beautifully made. They're pointy with a little square edge toe. The heel is really different on them. It's a nice square thick heel. Um, not too thick this way, but I do like this sort of like vibe. I think they're really, really funky. I just don't know how wearable they're gonna be. For me, they're a little bit too high in the ankle. Like they almost got the leg out too much. And then when I think something goes up the leg that much, if anyone has a slightly bigger calf, like I have quite big calves, and I just think it makes the calf look bigger which then overall gives the illusion of a bigger leg which i'm not saying anything wrong with big legs but we're not here to want big legs i personally don't want big legs or big looking legs so for me i don't think they're the most flattering if you're very very slim and slender and tall and then i think they'll be great but i think if you're not wanting same as me not wanting to look like you have bigger legs than you do Maybe they ain't for you. <laughs> they did, however, fit really nicely. Okay, we're gonna go on to something that we can maybe wear when we're out of lockdown because I love this. I wasn't sure on the cropped style of it, but having put it on, I did actually really like it. So this is £39.99, which I think is great price for what it is. I think it's great quality. I think it's really lovely. It looks very Chanel vibes, very expensive looking. Um, it's got the gold button details again. Like I said, you guys know I just love the gold. I just love the gold and I think it's really lovely. Um, I think as well, I've styled it a few different ways. I think it could be easily worn like over a dress or with like a combo with matching shorts, matching skirt, matching like slim like or some like nice slim skinny black jeans something like that very very classy so very easy to dress up i think it's going to dress up a lot of outfits it's not going to be so easy to wear like on an everyday occasion but nice to have a staple piece of like this in the wardrobe that will not go out of style ever chanel so timeless i know it's not chanel but it's very timeless and i can't see it going out of style 
to go with that i did order these so they're not exactly the same they're not the same like tweedy type um, material as the crop but they have still got three buttons on so i did pair them with this as well as it over a dress and i do actually really like these shorts they're a lovely quality um they're 29.99 i think super affordable the large fit quite nicely and um, they've got these buttons as well which is lovely and you can and do a little stitching to put your hand fully in the pocket there as well and um, they do have a little zip on the side i've always loved zara shorts i always think they're really affordable they're a nice fit for me they're like slightly a tiny bit too big which i kind of like for shorts and jeans really like if you'll see these are slightly a little bit too big as well because i just like to have a bit of extra room in them there's nothing worse than like things are poking in and then your back's poking out and you think i don't need this in my life <laughs> So yeah, for me, I like the fit of the slightly bigger size. Like if I go down to a medium, Alexa, alarm off. If I go down to a medium, I can't sit down in Zara things. I have to go large. So I like them. I would have liked as a combo them to be both tweed, but I do think you can mix and match them. And you obviously could wear them as complete separates as well, which is lovely. This just paired with like, even like a black version on the top I'm wearing now. Um, and then dress it up with some heels or something like that. It's going to be very, very versatile. And again, it's just a staple, gorgeous pair of shorts. So I've got a nice bit of loungewear to share with you as well. And I'll get to that in a bit. Um, before we get there, I've picked up these. So I've seen so many bloggers wearing these faux leather leggings from Zara. And I was like, I just want to try them for myself. Mm -mm. These were a major fail on me. Um, they were super tight around the waist. I thought that they had no give, no stretch in them at all. Um, so aren't really designed to fit everybody type or shape. Um, and <laughs> you really can see the cat away. I'm just breathing in and out here. Just breathing in and out. And this is what's happening with the button. I honestly think like you need to be comfortable in your body and love your body, whatever it is. You shouldn't try and fit into clothes. Clothes should fit us. Okay, so remember that. Like if you don't fit in a certain size, it's not because there's something wrong with you. It's because there's something wrong with the clothing size. Like honestly, I've ordered pieces from Zara before that have been enlarged and I can't get them on me. And I'm not exactly big. So <laughs> never ever take sizes of clothing to heart. Never ever take sizes of clothing personally and definitely never feel like it's anything you're doing. Um, yeah, if you want some more body positivity, a little bit more self love, come over to my Instagram because we've got plenty of that shit over there. And I feel like honestly, you guys need to love yourselves a bit more because life is so much easier if we don't give about things like that obviously i care about my health i care about my well-being but that's so much more important than my body the shape of it what size i am in a pair of clothes that just in case you didn't realize no one can see the labels of your clothes other than you um it's literally no big deal so just a little pep talk for any guys feeling a little bit uh, in jan about everything so i got your back and um, so on the note of these they're 19.99 so they are very affordable um, I think if I went up to an extra large, they would have been too big on the actual leg area. So I don't think that's an option. Um, they do also have a zip up the side. And to be honest, I just don't really like them that much. I just think they do actually look a little bit cheap, a little bit tacky, and they're not my vibe. So I hope you guys have realised. I feel like I'm going to bring a bit more realness to the channel this year. So like giving a little bit more, maybe sometimes a bit brutal opinions of things. But I just want to be super honest with you guys. And I don't want you spending your money in the wrong way. Like want you guys to feel better about yourselves so there's going to be a lot more of that over here this year so make sure you are subscribed not to miss out um, on any of the content that's coming to you guys this year um, and if you are feeling a little bit there uh, i have made a video which is how to feel more positive and ways to add positivity into your life in 2021 um, it's a 25 minute video so definitely sit down with a cup of tea switch all your distractions off and go and watch it it's definitely worth it if if, if one tip in there helps change your life it's worth it isn't it so and i there's so many hints and tips i called it five but i called it that and it's it's a lie there's like 20 something tips in there probably so yeah make sure you watch that after this video i'll leave it um at the end and underneath in the description box so next this is a jumper again i've seen a lot on instagram i've seen it in like the dark gray color though i really like the dark gray color i couldn't find it online you guys know my my go-to is cream it just is my go-to white or cream i absolutely love this style it's 29.99 um, and i hope you'll see in the cutaway i double rolled the neck because it is humongous the neck honestly when i unrolled it 
it was like up here it was like being in the victorian times with those things on your neck that you like elongate your neck it was literally like this so just yeah bear that in mind it's an extra long neck but i i double rolled it a bit so just a little tip um, i love how fat and chunky these arms are i love this a little bit cropped as well because like in the winter you don't see as much like crop stuff but especially at the moment we're like around the house you want to be comfy you want to be cozy but you want to look chic this your jam girl <laughs> Okay, okay, this is the last piece of knitwear, so I feel like I may as well show it to you now. I saw this on the website and I just loved it. It reminded me of like Scandinavian vibes, very like, I don't know, like Polish or Russian or like Icelandic or I don't know what it was. It just reminds me of like ski resorts and snowy places, which I just love. So um, I love this. It's 49.99. The large, oh, it's not even large, it's a medium. It's gigantic. I thought it was a large. I mean, it's meant to be oversized, but we all could probably fit in this. Um, as in like all of us combined, it's that big. So <laughs> defo, defo, defo size down, down, like two sizes down. Um, like I said, sometimes I wear a large and I think if I'd gone to a small, this probably would have been nicer. It's very, very low. So you're definitely gonna need to wear like a body or um, something quite cute underneath it because you'll be able to see a little bit of it here. I do think it's just lovely though. And I paired it really casually with like some faux leather leggings, which are not from Zara, but they are the best faux leather leggings I have tried on in my entire life. And they're only 12 99 and you can get a discount with my With Love Katie code. I will leave the link down below and you can thank me later. Um, they are the best, the best. I am wearing in those as well, a size medium to large. I'm UK 12. Okay, so you guys need those leggings in your life. And I've tried on every pair of full leather leggings under the sun. Um, and then just a really cutchy pair of boots, which I'll show you. So these are the boots. Again, I actually think they're probably real leather. Yep, they are real leather again. $69.99, bit more pricey. Do really like them though, do really like the flat boot. I think they're flat, they're classy, they're like everyday, they're timeless. They're really a great boot. I don't have that much more to say about them, like you can literally just take them in. <laughs> um, they've got a zip that's on the inside. Also, I have got wide feet, so for my wide fit girls, I have to say they were a struggle to get on, and I got a size eight. Sorry. Yeah, I got a size 8, they were trouble to get on. So just bear that in mind. When they were on, they were fine, they fit great, they just were hard to get my foot inside of. Okay, so also when I did this order, I also ordered a sale order. So that is coming in next week's video, next Sunday's video, so make sure you're subscribed. Put the alarm button on. And that's always there. So another faux leather again. As I said, I tried a lot of them on in my time. I was going to hang on there, no point in that though. Um, these fit so much better, they're stretchy, they've got more, way more give in the legs as well, they've got give around the waist, much comfier, much more flattering, 19 99 again, got them in size large. These were way better than the other ones. However, these are more like a faux leather trouser than a legging. Um, I do like these, and I do like them, don't I like them? I do like them. I just have pairs that I prefer, so I will not be keeping them. Um, I'm glad I tried them on. They do come in a lot of colours, all the leggings that I've shared with you today. So definitely, if you're not liking the beiges, um, I don't know why I went for three beige pairs of leggings. But you know, I'm a bit beige obsessed right now. Um, but yeah, okay, next I got another cute little crop jacket for you guys. Obviously, very in the season. Um, again, I think I wouldn't fear this in a longer version, but I do like the crop version, adds a bit of a change. Again, really timeless, classic piece. I've um, got the gold buttons on, which I'm absolutely loving. I don't think they're cheap or tacky or anything like that. And um, quite often with gold, it can be like that. I, I love the shape of the neckline. I love the material. Um, it's To be honest, it's not like the most inside exciting, well-made jacket, but it's 39.99, so it's like averagely priced. It is cute. It does look cute on. What do we think? If you're enjoying this video, guys, make sure you hit that thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed with the alarm bell button on. Join the Good Vibe Tribe. Follow me on Instagram. All that good stuff. Next we have, I feel like this is leather too. This is like a bloody leather ball. Sorry, guys. It is. I could smell it. Do you know what? That's why I could smell it. Obviously, all the leather pieces are going back. And moving forward, 
I will be a lot more conscious of what I'm buying because I don't really tend to look at materials of things when I buy them. I don't know if you guys do. Let me know if you do or you don't because I don't often. Um, so this is leather, that really explains the price. It's 89.99, but it's possibly the prettiest handbag I've seen in a long time. This is gonna be, like you could easily wear it now. I feel like this is the, the nicest like summer handbag, is it not? I love the detail on it, I think it's absolutely beautiful. It's gorgeously made. I absolutely am in love with the shape. I'm in love with the style of like the indoor bag that's like a drawstring bag has got a long strap on it as well and you can also clip that together at the top so you have a little bit of like that privacy which you don't normally have with bags like this packet bags um it is really gorgeous and if i do see this in like a faux leather i will definitely have to buy it for the summer i think it's gonna look gorgeous with like a nice little white dress and some tan sandals the perfect summer outfit i just saw it and i was like in love with pattern on it so i was like i gotta get it but obviously we ain't supporting that leather life okay few more little bits to share. I've got these gorgeous little shorts. Now these are really gonna be versatile for like dressing up and down. Could easily wear them with tights and those really nice high knee boots. High knee? High knee boots. Yeah, high knee boots. I think like over the knee, no. High knee boots, tights, these nice chunky black roll neck jumper. So nice for the winter. And then easily worn on a neck and nice out with a nice little sexy top, which I might just show you in a minute. Um, and some little heels, really, really cute, really, really versatile. And again, you could even wear this in the summer with a little like black crop and some black flip flops, like some of those vegan socks. You can actually get vegan vegan socks now as well. The world is finally listening. Oh, yeah, I am excited about this vegan journey. Anyone else? Anyone else vegan over here? If you are, let me know. I don't know what this dance is about. <laughs> Okay, so I'm in love with this top. I feel like it's really 90s. Um, I feel like it's very classic, very 90s, very simple. I love the shape of it. It's square neckline. It's slightly on the large side. It is a large. I think if I got a medium in this, it would fit perfection. So definitely keep an eye out on the website for it in a medium. I could definitely get away with a large if it ever comes back in stock in a medium because I feel like I can't live without it. I lo just love it. It's the most classic black top I've ever seen in my life. It's just, it's just so 90s. I can't even tell you. I just love it. It's got a zip up the back. It's got this really like flattering, subtle like line through the waist, and then this like it's not boning. It's just a line down the front. I'm obsessed. It doesn't have a price sales. I don't know how much it was, but I think it was really, really affordable as well. Like maybe around the 20 pound mark. All things, and then I'll show you the boots. I promise. Okay, so on to some comfy loungewear. This is just like a really gorgeous chocolate brown oversized um, jumper. It's got nice balloon sleeves. I'm obsessed with the balloon sleeve. I just love anything a bit extra with the sleeve going on. I love a frill, I love a ruffle, I love a balloon sleeve. I also like the fact that it's elasticated here, so it cinches you in, so it's gonna give you more of like an hourglass figure than like a normal jersey jumper would. Um, I think it's gonna be very flattering, very comfy. I got it in a large, I think I could have sized down to a medium. It's 19.99, so again, really affordable, nice chocolate brown colour. I really like the colour of it. I think brown, as you can see, there's so many shades of brown. As you'll see, like the next piece, like look, I've got three different shades of brown in this one shot. Um, but yeah, I really like that. Oh, I don't think I filmed these. Did I? I don't know if I filmed the colourway on these. These are a lovely pair of joggers. For me, they're more like a rusty, burnt orange colour, like burnt orangey brown. Got them in a large, $17.99. They fit really nice. I don't know why I'm so out of breath. <sighs> so yeah, the fit on these is really nice. They're really comfy. They're really soft. Really like good quality lounge dress. If you're looking nice for a nice little pair of joggers just, just around the house, these will be just perfect for that. I like the way they go in at the bottom. And what I do really like on these is they're a little bit longer as they go at the bottom. I think that really does elongate the leg a little bit more quite flattering and um, I, I don't know about you guys but I like to look chic in the house as well I don't want to just like feel slumpy like don't get me wrong like half days where I don't wear makeup I have days where I don't do my hair and I just wear like whatever was on my bedroom floor but at the same time like I don't have many days like that I have more days where I think right let's get up let's put something on that makes me feel good Alexa alarm off let's put something on that makes me feel good I feel like it just starts the day in a better way it makes me start the day in like a different mental headspace 
if that makes sense. Um, so like putting on some chic loungewear, maybe like a nice white body or something like that, maybe a black body, um, that would look really cute, or even like a little cream crop. Um, in the Zara sale haul next week, there's lots of really cute little crops, so make sure you are, like I said, subscribed. To see that one! Okay, so the final piece of clothing that I have to show you is this jumper. Again, I styled this over on my Instagram um, in a reel, and you guys loved it. And I actually just shared a post of it too, and you guys are literally loving it. It's like an icy blue. It's $25.99. As you can see, it's very small, but it does obviously have that stretch in. I've got this in a size medium, I want to say, yeah. And it's um, it's just like nice and like ribbed and body and... It's just a little bit different. It's nice to have something that's a little bit different. I like these like thin knit jumpers as well for like every day. Really easy to just chuck on, like I said, be chic in the house without really making any effort. Chuck your hair up in like a top knot bun. Put this on with some like nice comfy cream joggers, awesome jeans, your favorite pair of jeans, literally gonna look instant, easy, chic. This unfortunately is sold out at the time I'm filming this. Um, I know it's in stock in black, um, so if you guys like it, definitely head down to the links um, below and get it quick set. And the moment you've all been waiting for. I've shared this on my Instagram already like two or three times. And every time I've had like floods of messages of you guys like, Oh my god, I need them. Oh my god, I need them. Yes, I know. I know. Okay, we're done. Okay, so they're a gorgeous pointy toe, ankle black boot. They've got this gorgeous chain detail on. I am obsessed. I love them. Thirty nine ninety nine. I think that's a great price for a pair of boots. Please don't be leather. Oh my god. Oh my god, they're not leather. Okay, <laughs> guys, I think they're leather. <laughs> Someone just put my balloon right now. I think they're leather, what? I didn't think they'd be leather for that price. It doesn't even say, like normally Zara's like quite bold to put like leather on. Anyway, I'll have to find out if they're leather. I can't really read the instructions um, or what the, whatever it's not instructions. I can't read the card properly. Um, but they are beautiful and a gorgeous pair to finish on. I hope you guys like them. If you do, Pop that thumbs up, help my video get seen. And if you enjoyed today's video, make sure you do hit that thumbs up if you enjoyed um, this new Zara haul, our first haul of 2021. It's taken me a little while, I know. It took a, little, took a while for the Zara order to come, okay? Did order it about two weeks ago. So, sorry about that. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you did enjoy. And I will hopefully see you in the next video. Like I mentioned, definitely head to my Instagram and say hey over there. And definitely um, watch the video if you're feeling a little bit in the slump, or you're just not feeling quite yourself, definitely pop and watch the video on my five ways to add more happiness and more enjoyment and just feel better about life into your life video. I messed that up a bit, but there we are. Um, I'll leave it on the screen now and I will leave it in the description box. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you to Italia Jewelry for sponsoring today's video. Make sure if you do pop into their website, you use my discount code at the checkout. I'll leave it again on the screen here now and I will also leave it in the description box. Thank you guys for being here. Bye. Make sure you subscribe for next week's Zara Sale Haul.